Hey YouTube, what's up? This is Taz Olson here, and today I'm going to show you a little, quick little guide on how to increase the power of one specific program. Uh, specifically, if you are rendering a video and you want it to get done faster, or you know, if you are working with only one program and you need it to work as fast as is possible, especially with video editing on lower computers, this is effective. Um, so let's get into this uh, first. Let's open up Sony Vegas and. Uh, yeah. So here, let's put down large tiles and let's just extend this ridiculous amount. Eee! You know, make it fairly long, and then you know what? Let's just copy it and paste it a couple times. And so now we have a almost an hour long video um, this is just as an example to show you um, you know let's render this uh, 720p 30 frames per second sounds about good um, now let's just save it as untitled now it's going to proceed to render um, now it's still gaining the approximate time left uh, but if you want to increase how fast this is going to go you know what, better yet let's do it with a shorter video so I can show you um, it a bit more in real time let's go with just the nine minute thing so let's save this as entitled again now we see this you know it's moving along now if you open up task manager which you can do by right clicking on your taskbar and going to task manager you come up with all these things uh, usually it'll start on applications for me I use processes a lot so uh, applications and you will start with uh, it shows all the main applications you have running and then if you go to processes you get all these applications you have running and uh, if you go show processes from all users you get even more. Uh, you get the ones from all the users. Um, however, I am not going to show them exactly. You're going to hit cancel because I don't need it for this particular video. Now you'll notice it's you know this is moving at a certain speed. Um, so now, if you want to increase this speed, you know you right-click on the program you want. Um, if you have multiple uh, types of that program open at once. Uh, you can click on it, and then go to processes. Say you find what you are looking for. You know, Vegas Nine is what I'm using because I find Nine better than Ten. Anyway, so you select it, and uh, how you change the po this power is you go to set priority by right clicking, and uh, you can choose all these things. Uh, if you want to increase it. Um, you go to above normal or high or real time, not so much. And then below normal or low um, for programs that you don't need to go as fast to run them normally, which gives this uh, the program with the highest priority even more power. Uh, as you can see, if you uh, you'll need, you know, you need to be uh, confirm it. and suddenly you will be running like this particular thing will be running a lot faster um, you know it's probably not too noticeable but in the long run you will uh, depending on how long the video you will save uh, quite a bit of uh, like quite a fair chunk per, uh, percentage like usually uh, it's between like 20 and 30 percent on a fairly long video like I usually make so like on save time in rendering by setting it to high priority um, but then you know set it back to normal afterwards otherwise it'll just it does sap all the power from your other programs running and you can't just set them all to uh, high priority because then you know you're not gonna change anything um, I recommend just doing like one program you increase the power and it, it will be noticeable uh, I have definitely noticed it and the last little while when I've been using it so you know that's that um, the video is rendering faster now so uh, I'm just gonna cancel because I don't need that video actually obviously it's just flat tiles anyway so that's all I have for now 
my name is Taz Olson, um, signing off. If you have any other ideas for videos, let me know. Bye.